Hello, welcome to Mama Sue's Kitchen. Today, I am in a hurry to get out of the house and I wanted to put on something that we're gonna have tonight and to show you how fast you can do it. It's a recipe that's in my volume one cookbook on page 30 and it's called crock pot cilantro lime chicken. Now, we're gonna start off with some chicken breast and you can use the breast or the tenderloins. This is frozen. I'm going to put four in here. All right. Now, on top of that, I'm going to put one tablespoon of cumin. Whoops. One tablespoon of chili powder. One teaspoon of garlic powder. And the recipe calls for the juice of a lime, but this recipe was before I got the Y'all brand lime pepper. So I'm going to add a tablespoon of this. And let me tell you, if you say, where can you get it? I'm gonna link it, and if you order it and you write in the code SUE with all caps, you're gonna get 10% off. All right, then, I didn't bring it over here, so I've got to, to do it. I had a bunch of cilantro, and I've already washed it, and I'm gonna chop it. Okay, just sprinkle it on top. And the very last thing that I'm going to do is take a 15 ounce can of tomato sauce and pour it on top. Now the recipe called for salt and pepper to taste. All right, the lime pepper took care of the pepper part. And I'm just gonna sprinkle some salt. Then I'm gonna plug it up and I'm gonna cook it on low, six to eight hours. And then I'll be back to show you what we'll do right before we eat it. See how simple that was? Now I can leave and run my errands. Be back soon. Okay, this is cooked on low, uh, well, all day. It was really about seven hours. And what I did, I took two forks and I just, Pour it all to pieces. Let's see if you can see. Now, the recipe in the book says to shred and stir and serve over rice. But what I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to have tacos with it. I heated these um, taco shells. And I'm gonna put some of the chicken. And it, I tasted it, it's very, very good. And then I'm gonna put some grated cheese. You can put whatever you want on your tacos. 
grated cheese, and I like onion. And cilantro. So, from this that I, it took me, I think I looked back and it was three minutes and 40 something seconds to get this in the crock pot this morning. The four chicken breast tenderloins and the other ingredients. But just see how simple it was. And all I did after I got home was I took two forks and just shred the chicken in here. And I have enough that we'll probably have two tacos a piece with some left over that maybe tomorrow I can have for lunch. But with some uh, salsa, on t this is gonna be so, so good. So I just wanted to show you how you can take a crock pot meal and not have to worry during the day. Remember, it's this recipe is on page 30 in my volume one. And you know, if you want to order, to go to mamasoussouthernkitchen.com. And there you'll be able to order uh, my volume one and volume two. And I also have my shirts and aprons there and caps. So I just uh, wanted to help you that way. But remember, let others see Jesus in you. And when you're having a, a bad day, just have faith that God is with you. It doesn't matter what you're going through. He said he would never leave us. And just remind yourself of that and smile. Give someone a smile because you never know. You never know what they're going through. But thank you for joining me and check me out on uh, YouTube. I'll be back soon.